Hola! Let's talk about ER verbs. In Spanish, we have three types of verbs. AR verbs like hablar, ER verbs like comer, and IR verbs like vivir. They are all pretty similar in terms of conjugating, but let's focus on the ER verbs. Some examples of ER verbs are beber, to drink, comer, to eat, creer, to believe, and creer en, means to believe in something, and leer, to read. Let's review how to conjugate AR verbs first since they are very similar to each other. If you're using the note-taking printable, you'll see a pencil appear when it's time to take notes. Let's start with hablar, which means to talk or to speak. The forms are Yo hablo, I talk. Tú hablas, you talk. Él, ella, usted habla. He, she, it, or you formal talk. Nosotros hablamos, we talk. And ellos, ellas, ustedes hablan. They talk, or you all talk. Remember, we only need to drop the last two letters off the end of the verb and then make sure the ending of the verb matches the pronoun we want. So, for the pronoun yo, we would drop the AR and add an O. For the pronoun tu, we would drop the AR and add an AS. For the pronouns el, ella, and usted, we drop the AR and then add an A. You can remember this with the rhyme he or she, use an A or E. For the pronoun nosotros, we would drop the AR and add an AMOS and for the pronouns ellos, ellas, and ustedes, we would drop the AR and then add an AN. Let's see this in action with the ER verb comer, to eat. Yo como helado. I eat ice cream. <clears throat> Tú comes todo el tiempo. You eat all the time. Él, ella, usted, Come naranjas. He, she, it, or you formal, eat oranges. Nosotros no comemos los insectos. We don't eat bugs. <laughs> Ellos, ellas, ustedes, comen verduras. They eat or you all eat vegetables. If you compare this to the AR verbs, you'll see it's basically the same. Let's look at another example, leer, to read. Now, don't get stumped by all the E's. It still follows the same pattern. So, yo, leo, drop the ER and add an O for I read. Tu, les, drop the ER, add an ES for you read. El, ella, usted, le, drop the ER, then add an E on and you're done. Remember the rhyme. For he or she, use an A or an E. This gives us he, she, it, or you formal reads. Now, nosotros leemos, drop the ER, and add an EMOS for we read. And the last one, ellos, ellas, ustedes, leen, drop the ER, and add an EN for they or you all read. Te toca a ti, it's your turn. Remember to pause the video, give yourself time to think. Let's start with the verb leer. Take a look at the four statements below and see if you can correctly conjugate the verb. Did you get yo leo muchos libros? Nosotros leemos a la biblioteca. Ellos no leen en la cama. And the last one, tú lees libros de horror. Did you get them correct? Hopefully you did, but if you didn't, you can always go back and practice again. Now let's practice with comer. Take a look at the next four statements and see if you can correctly conjugate the verb. Remember to pause so that you have time to think. Did you get, ellas no comen las hamburguesas? Yo necesito comer mis verduras. María come su pan con mantequilla. And the last one, nosotras comemos mucha chocolate. All right, let's try the last set and let's use the verb creer. Take a look at the last four statements.
see if you can correctly conjugate the verb. Remember to pause the video to give yourself time to think. Well, let's see how you did. Did you get, ellos no creen en los ejercicios? Yo creo que las muchachas son bonitas. Ustedes creen que el libro está en la biblioteca? And finally, Paul cree que hay un error. Well, muy bien. Hopefully you found that helpful. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions or suggestions. Um, and hopefully this helped you. Adios y hasta pronto.